vapor trails in the skies over the United Arab Emirates. Strategically located between the east and the west, the United Arab Emirates has not only evolved as an aviation hub for the freight and passenger sectors, it has also become a significant player in the maintenance, repair and overhaul industry for aircrafts from all over Europe and Asia. To meet the fast-growing demands of the MRO sector, Abu Dhabi Aircraft Technologies, ADAT, awarded Aircraft Support Industries the contract to build the prestigious Hangar No. 6. With head offices in Australia, Aircraft Support Industries was established in 1985 and have branches in different parts of Europe and Asia. ASI is highly specialized in facilities planning, designing and construction of aircraft maintenance facilities from concept through to project completion and handover. ASI specialties cover a wide range of structures, mainly for the aviation industry. ADAT required a three-bay hangar, with each bay capable of accommodating one A380, along with two smaller A320s, to be built adjacent to their existing facilities in Abu Dhabi. ASI's team went to work with the original design plans provided by the client. With an enviable track record in designing and building hangars, from simple single-unit structures to large commercial aircraft facilities, the design team could not only see the challenges, but also recognize possibilities that would add value to the venture. The result was an L-shaped triangular design concept that, in fact, took advantage of the site constraints while simultaneously providing future development possibilities for Adat's land bank. The design also allowed for greater overall number of aircraft combinations and better surrounding flexibility for aircraft access, movements and parking. The workshops and offices were also centrally located. What's more, there was even an overall cost reduction by 27.5%. The hangar roof was effectively designed to minimize the tonnage of the steel required. The roof steelwork comprised of separate sections for each bay and weighed 2,000 tons each. ASI uses strand jacking technology to raise such high and heavy roofs. The great advantage of this technique is that it allows the roof to be completed at ground level, which in turn avoids time-consuming and dangerous work at heights. All services mounted on the roof were installed prior to the lift. And in just seven and a half months after the contract was signed, the first of the three roofs was ready. The final preparations for the lift were underway. ASI owns all the strand jacking equipment and operates the lift through its sister company, ASI Heavy Lift. As Hangar 6B's roof was getting ready, Hangar 6A's roof was all systems go for the lift. Although this was one of the heaviest strand jacking operations in the region, ASI's heavy lift team were not new to this technique. They had a track record of successfully completing several installations, which included hangars in the Middle East, Asia and Australia. And so, in January 2010, at the press of a button, slowly but steadily, the 2,000-ton structure was on its way up to its final position 40 meters above the ground. Roof lifts for the other two bays followed in quick succession. Work progressed rapidly, 
and by 31st January 2011, Hangar No. 6 was completed and handed over, on time, on budget. The L-shaped design was a sure winner. The 50,000 square meters apron offered convenient parking areas, as well as easy access and flexibility of movements for the aircraft. The three hangar bays total a floor area of 32,000 square meters. The annex at the back has a floor area of 12,000 square meters, over two floors, which houses the offices, workshops, stores, restaurants, washrooms, and other utilities. The fully air-conditioned hangar utilizes segmented vertical lift doors to ensure that it can be fully sealed against the vagaries of the wind and the weather, especially during dust storms. The segments allow opening just the required area to remove a particular aircraft type, thus conserving energy. The roof structure is designed to accommodate the imposed loads of overhead cranes, teleplatforms, and future installations of suspended docking systems. The hangar floors have service pits for all utility functions, which include different air supplies for varied demands. 400 Hz power supply, fuel exhaust, and water. Besides improving efficiency and convenience, the layout of the pits help reduce occupational health and safety issues. The advanced HAVAC system ensures that the 1.3 million cubic meters of hangar volume is maintained to optimum standards. The fire detection and protection systems are fully NFPA 409 compliant. They are designed to discharge foam and water at a rate of 100 cubic meters a minute from the roof, water cannons, and from the floor as well. ASI understands that well-designed hangars are crucial to the safety, protection, and maintenance of aircrafts. A well-designed hangar also means quick turnarounds that keep aircrafts in the air. And so, 18 months after the contract was signed, ASI delivered this advanced hangar. Hangar 6. On time and on budget allowing ADAT to commence operations as booked and make immediate return on the investment. Aircraft Support Industries. Support from the ground up.